Texas Children's Hospital Sports Medicine presents Concussions. A concussion is a mild traumatic brain injury that can occur from a direct blow or a jolt to the head or body. This can be a result from a fall, hitting a hard surface, coming in contact with a ball, or even with another person. Concussions are diagnosed by licensed healthcare professionals. A concussion is a chemical injury to the brain, not a physical injury to the brain, thus cannot be detected by imaging. Imaging may be used in special circumstances to evaluate for other injuries, but is not required for a concussion diagnosis. Think about your brain as a soda bottle. Sustaining a concussion is just like shaking up a bottle of soda. You want to allow that bottle to settle down. The same goes for a concussed brain. Don't shake the bottle. Concussion symptoms can be classified into several different categories. Physical symptoms may include headache, fatigue, pressure in head, neck pain, nausea, vomiting, dizziness, blurry vision, and sensitivity to light or noise. Cognitive symptoms may include difficulty concentrating, difficulty remembering, not feeling right, feeling foggy, drowsiness, and confusion. Emotional symptoms may include nervousness, anxiety, irritation, and sadness or depression. Concussions may also cause sleep disturbances, such as difficulty falling asleep and not being able to stay asleep. Every individual will experience symptoms differently and may experience some or many of these symptoms. Call 911 or go to the emergency room immediately if a person with a concussion has repeated vomiting or increasing nausea, is excessively tired or cannot be awakened, develops slurred speech, convulsions, or seizures, becomes increasingly confused, restless, agitated, or has unusual behavior, has amnesia of recent events, or loses consciousness. Recovering from a concussion takes time and proper management as guided by your doctor. Recovery recommendations include getting at least eight hours of sleep on a normal schedule. Sleep is encouraged to give the brain rest. Stop participation in sports or physical activity until safely cleared by a healthcare professional. Limit time playing video games, watching TV, texting, or any other activity that involves concentrating on a screen as these activities may increase symptoms. If you're of driving age, don't drive for at least 24 hours after sustaining a concussion and avoid or limit driving while symptoms persist. Driving with a concussion can be dangerous. Maintaining good eating habits and staying hydrated is also needed for the brain to heal. Don't skip meals and drink plenty of water. School modifications may be necessary to give your brain the rest it needs while still attending normal days of school. A doctor can help with these modifications. When recovering from a concussion, a good rule of thumb is, if it makes symptoms worse, avoid it. Once your brain recovers fully, you will be able to return to normal activities as guided by your doctor. Just like a snowflake, every concussion is unique. Recovery time will vary depending on the severity of initial symptoms and how well you follow management recommendations. Recognizing and recovering from a concussion is very important. Sustaining a second concussion before fully recovering from the first concussion can result in second impact syndrome which can be fatal. Not properly recovering from a concussion can lead to extended duration of symptoms and even cause long-term deficits. Be sure to follow all recovery recommendations as guided by your doctor. If you have any questions or believe that you or someone you know has sustained a concussion, contact a healthcare provider.